her little sister, and her comatose twin brother move into a new house with their single mother Joan in order to save money to help pay for her brother's expensive health care. But when strange phenomena begin to occur in the house including the miraculous recovery of her brother, Belle begins to suspect her mother isn't telling her everything and soon realizes they just moved into the infamous Amityville house. Amityville, The Awakening, 36 After many delays, the fans of the famous brand Amityville are finally about to enjoy a new version of the horror story on Long Island. The Awakening is set in modern times when a family moved to a haunted home on 112 Ocean Avenue. Bella Thorne, Jennifer Jason Lee and Cameron Monaghan are Amityville's 10th movie stars. So, in all honesty, we'll probably be lucky to see Amityville, The Awakening before 2018. Frank Calfown is a very talented director, so I had some very high hopes for the film. We haven't seen a legitimately good Amityville film since Stuart Rosenberg's 1979 The Amityville Horror, but those hopes have become fears at this point. There simply has to be a reason for the re 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 I can't fathom how that reason could be positive. This may be the last time we discuss this film for some time. The new release date is June 30, 2017, but that probably won't happen, either, as that would leave the movie competing against World War Z2, which would have only been in theaters a few weeks by the time the 30th of June rolls around. What is this, the fifth, or sixth time Amityville, The Awakening has been delayed? It's certainly been delayed more than any other recent release, and that's beginning to lead to some serious personal doubts. If Dimension felt they had a major hit on their hands, they'd push that major hit in our direction as soon as humanly possible. But Amityville, The Awakening just continues to be delayed.